Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, I want to talk about Samsung One UI Beta Number Three for the Samsung Galaxy S10, which happens to be Android 10. So let's dive in and see the new things we got with this newest beta update. So first and foremost, let's go to my settings real quick. I'm going to go all the way down, go into my software update. I'm going to tap on the last update, and as you can see, that was done on November the 8th. And if I tap on this one, it's going to give me the expansion. It's going to say, thank you for participating in the One UI beta program. The third beta software update contains the following implementations. And what we have here is a huge list of bug fixes. So if you pause the video and you read this over here, you'll see there's so many bugs that have been fixed. And I have noticed as I'm using the smartphone, the animations have smoothened out and the performance and overall responsiveness of the software has gotten improved. So we are getting closer and closer to the final version as we fix all these bugs. Again, you can pause the video, read all this right over here. At the bottom here, I'm seeing keyboard stabilization. We have camera stabilization. We have gallery stabilization, messages, recent apps, and other modifications. Again, you can pause this and read this, and uh, that's basically all there is to it, all right? So let's go back out real quickly. And first, I want you guys to notice how nice and smooth the animations are right now. So if I pull this up uh, to bring up the uh, recent apps, as I swipe back and forth, it's super smooth, buttery smooth, and also there's a little bouncing effect, okay? This is not something that we have on the regular One UI, but with One UI 2.0, you get this nice little bouncing effect. And if I go back home, if I launch the phone application, the way it just launches nice and smooth is very cool. Now let me go back out. Even the way it goes back in is amazing. So let me launch this, okay? You saw the way it came up. Let's see how it goes down, boom. And as you can see, I'm using the full screen gestures, all right? So I'm gonna pull it up from the bottom. Uh, if I want to go into settings, for example, and if I tap on, uh, just as an example, display, if I wanna go back, I'm swiping uh, just like you would do in Android 10. So these are the full screen gestures that I've enabled uh, right over here under navigation bar. As you can see, you can go back to the buttons if that's the way you like it, which is something I do like. But really with this, uh, with this update, with the beta 3 update, I haven't seen any new features. All I've seen is overall bug improvements and also overall stabilization of the actual software. And of course, we do have some new icon shapes at the bottom here. And one more thing, if I go into the settings over here, okay, I think I showed this guys to you before. Uh, over here under the device care, uh, we have a brand new screen. So it looks different with all the same functionality. If I go to the battery, you got this different shape and size. You got these different icons. Everything is more smooth and consistent overall. Even with the way the folders uh, come up, uh, expand is much smoother. I can tap here, it goes right back. Uh, if I tap on this one, it expands nice and slow. And what I really like here is if I tap on this button, you can pick any color you want and you can also preview what it's gonna look like on the outside. So I'm gonna X on that, I'm gonna tap here, and you can see the preview in the folder before you actually save it. So I'm gonna exit out again, boom, all right? So that's it, I mean, really not much going on. This is the Samsung One UI 2.0 beta number three with Android 10 running on the S10 Plus. Like I said, all we have is overall stabilization to the actual interface and of course the bug fixes. If you have noticed something new, drop a comment down below and let me know. And for now guys, have a fantastic day. I'm looking forward to the next beta number four.